was created for purpose. Every one of you got a purpose here in life. Every single one of you, man. And don't you go through life just wasting your time and destroying your life, missing your purpose. Every one of you been created for purpose. Every one of you been created for an, a particular assignment to do something great, to do something special. And what football does, football prepares you in the arena and gets you equipped to succeed in your purpose. Because your purpose going to require determination. Your purpose is going to require commitment. Your purpose is going to require dedication. Your, your purpose is going to require endurance, which means that you cannot quit when you start something. You must finish because it's not how fast you start anyway. It's how you finish. A football team can start winning 6 and all, but yet down the stretch, they, they lose. So it's not how you start on um, Woodhall, but it's how you finish. It's not how you start the first quarter. It's not how you start the second quarter. It's not how the third quarter looks. But what counts is how you finish in the fourth quarter. Because why? Everything is for possibility. Which means that the team that believes more stronger than you have a possibility to come back and capitalize on your, your, your just... Take a thing for granted. You can't take it for granted. You, you got to believe, man. And you got to believe that you can, you're the team that can win a state champion. You're the team that, man, that you represent this county. You're the team. You got to believe that you are the team. I don't care what team they talk about. You must believe you are the team. And no matter what forces you hear on the outside, no matter what the news reporter says, you have to believe in your heart that you are the team. Bring it out! Man. Bring it out! Man. Nobody! Nobody! Stop us! Stop us! No team! No team! No team! No team. You got to believe that. We don't just say it. I'm not giving you guys right up the same word just to say it, but I'm trying to get you the same word and believe it in your heart that what you say and you believe it strong enough, it will come to pass. I'm, I'm a witness to that, guys. Everything I set out to do, and I believe that I can do it, I'm doing it. But you got to believe it first. You got to believe it first. When everybody around you thinks it's impossible, you the one got to say it's possible. Because if you don't think the best of yourself, who else will? So on, on, on the field, the person you play in the front of, you got to believe you better than him. I don't care what size he is. I don't care what speed he has. You must believe that you're better than him. Cornerback, you must believe that you're a better cornerback than a receiver. Lyman, you must believe that you're a better blocker than the defensive lineman in front of you. You must believe that. And when you begin to believe that with a strong conviction, then you begin to walk that way. You begin to talk that way. You begin to act that way with confidence. Confidence! 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 confidence. confidence. Bring it out! Hey. See, you got to see, when you believe that strong conviction, then confidence on the inside of you begin to rise up. Man, you just don't know how much power that you, you, you have. Man, you don't know how much power you have on the inside of you, but that power has to be released. And that's what I'm doing. I'm trying to draw that power out of you. I, not your, just your abilities and skills. I'm talking about something greater than that. That's something greater than that. See, the mind. See, as a man thinketh, so is he. It's, it, see, you're going to win most of your battles right here. This is really where to fight at, right here in the mind. Right here. When the body wants to shut down, the mind says, no, you're not going to shut down. You're going to push it. You're going to sacrifice. You're going to take it to the next level. You're going to push it. You're going to press. The, the mind begins to tell the body that. Then the body begins to respond to what the mind says. Then the body begins to release that energy and power to accomplish what you just said. It's amazing when you believe it, you begin to say it, and then your body begins to set out and achieve it. That's what we do with you guys. That's why we say what we say. We confess certain things because what we're doing, we tell it, the mind is telling the body, no, no, this is who you are. You are not lazy, you're strong. This is who you are. You're a powerful, you're a powerful lineman. You're a powerful tackle. You're a powerful running back. When you run the ball, the, the, the person got to think twice, do he want to hit you? Believe that one guy can put 
put you down. See, when you believe not one guy can put you on the ground, something else changes. When you believe that, it don't take two guys to get you out of the way, but you can, you can get to the ball with one guy, or you can get the ball just that quick. Something inside of you changes, man. The power to believe, man. And that's what, that's what you have to do as a team. Let me share something with you. Let me share something with you. Let me share something with you. Thank you, man. Let me share something with you, man. This team, it was a team, they, they decided called the Tower of Babel. And, and they, they decided to build a tower that would reach heaven. This group of guys got this together, together and said, hey, we can build a tower that can reach heaven. heaven. And you know, in the natural, that was impossible to do. That was impossible. But what? There's something amazing when a team get together on one accord and begin to believe the same thing. And so they, this team got together believing the same thing, everyone, no one doubting that they can build this tower that reach heaven. Guess what? They start to accomplish that goal. As a matter of fact, they was about to accomplish the goal, and God had to come down from heaven and change their language. To mix up their language. Why? Because it wasn't God's assignment for them to build a tower that reached heaven, but because of the power of belief, they got together and they began to achieve it. That's why it's so important team has to work in unity. That's why it's so important that teams got to come together. They got to have one mind, thinking the same thing, saying the same thing. When some leader takes the charge, don't have time to come on the field, say focus. Everybody got to say focus. Not one missing it, not two missing it, but everybody saying focus. Everybody saying confident. Everybody focused that they believe that they are the greatest. I'm 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 the best. 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 Nobody. Nobody. It's like me. It's like me. Nobody. Nobody. They rock like me. Nobody. Nobody. They run like me. Nobody. Nobody. They catch like me. I'm the best. I'm the best. I'm the best. I'm the best. Bring it out. Bring it out. You got to believe that. You got to believe that, man. You got to believe that. When you believe that, man, let me tell you, that's when the power is released. If this one I'm trying to pull out of you guys, man. You will have unstoppable power. You know what they said about the men that was going to, to, to reach heaven to build that tower? The word of God said, because they believe together, there is nothing that they cannot do. When you come together as a team and believe together, oneness, work together, practice together, you are one Powerful team. The Onward Hawks, there's nobody like you. Matter of fact, there are players want to get here to play for Onward. Why? Because Onward Hawks, you are unique by yourself. You're in a class all by yourself. Why? Because you're the best. And guess what? Nobody can outblock you. Nobody can outcatch you. Nobody can outstop you. Nobody. That's why we refuse to take defeat. We refuse it. Get how far we behind. It's just a matter of time, because why? We believe nobody can stop us. You got to believe that. Tonight, you got to get on that field. You got to play like nobody can stop your position. You're the best in that position. No one can stop you. No one. No. See, no one. No, no one. No team. No team. No team. No team. No team. No team. That's why when I think about the hog, when I think about speed, I think about 